Hey everybody, I'm Russ and welcome to Flashback. Episode 2 of Besiegers starts right about now. Let's see, load first Earth Day. Yep, I remember that one. Alright, let's get this thing started. Should I put this on pause maybe while we load? Because that could cause a lot of lag. What was pause again? F11? F, F11? Where is it? Nope, that's screenshot. Ah, to heck with it. We'll just go with it. Hold on to your seatbelts. Hey, everybody. All right, let's try this one more time. And start timer. Excellent. Earlier, I had a crash and I lost some data. So, I'm running the program in compatibility. Well, technically, it's not in compatibility mode. For some reason, if I try running it in compatibility mode, it just doesn't register that it's actually playing a game. It's really annoying. There are some serious issues trying to run it on such a, an advanced computer at such a late stage. But hopefully it won't be too bad. I increased the resolution. I hope that doesn't have anything bad happen. Where's my healer? Where? I gotta have her. Oh lord, she's... no, healing? no, that's not Good. cool. That is not cool. Get get up there with the troops, lady. Get up there with the troops. Uh, I'll try to remember as much as I can about what I talked about earlier before the crash happened. Because unfortunately when the program crashed, it, it uh, closed the whole program Ace out. And I, I didn't get the chance to press save on... Um, Enemy near. I didn't get the chance to press save on Bandai Cam. So, I didn't even get the chance to save the data. Good part about it is, though, even though it's not running in compatibility mode, Vikings, enemy spotted. Um, all, the, all of the game, uh, all of the game is pretty, pretty fast now, again. Because I noticed that it's running a lot faster whenever, okay, this is ridiculous. I need everyone, no, no, no. See, I almost lost a guy. Everybody, get back into the single unit. Ah. Okay. Enemy near. I'm gonna try to do a good 15-minute episode. I've got my timer set for it. Because unfortunately, oh, that ah, that wolf didn't stand a chance. I've got my timer set for it because uh, the last time I was trying for a 13-minute episode, and at about I guess 23 or 24 minutes in. The whole thing just went straight to garbage. Totally crashed. It was uh -huh. a nightmare. But you're not going to miss anything because I'm going to do everything exactly Enemy the same here. way as I did it before. Oh no, please don't kill that guy. Ah. I didn't lose anyone the last time. <sighs> That's frustrating. I don't get it. Why won't they group up? I've got them in column. That winds up with some of them further back than the others, so it's not a great formation. Let's try Phalanx. And these camera angles. Oh boy. <laughs> enemy near. Okay, enemy near. Oh, see, see, more enemies. And they're gonna go get this thing. Apparently because it spawns wolves. Uh, I wish I could have saved the data from the last time. That really makes me sad. I don't know if I should split the recordings up just to make sure, you know, how they say how they say uh, save early and often. Enemy I near. I can't even remember what I was talking about before. Ha <laughs> ha! He went down. No trouble. No trouble at all. Uh, I might reduce that screen resolution a little. It's pretty Enemy darn near. high. Let's see. Now those those are quite a few ogres. We're gonna want to let them come to me at least a little bit. Yeah. Let's let them come to me for a little bit. No! Everyone get back! See, why do they run up like that? Stop it. Oh man, they're ridiculous. Alright, alright, good, good. Group up, group up. Whew! Good, good. Oh man, that was rough. They just Enemy run near. all over the place. Whew! Nightmare. 
Who are you? And why did your men help our warriors to free us? Does it matter? I am Barmalay, an earl from a town to the east. I am glad to be of service. Do not rejoice yet, brother. These ogres were mere guards. They have an entire army at their disposal, and reinforcements are surely on the way. They have taken a liking to our village. It is said that their shaman has grown tired of living in the caves. We shall try to stop them. There are but a few of us, and the ogres will return with an army. Still, we should have time to rebuild the village and prepare for their attack. Ah, oh, man, I just realized the audio from the game is probably mixing with the audio from the mic. Realizing, realizing I already had a sawmill. Will do. I'm going to put him straight in there. Huh? And get my two idle workers to chopping some trees down. Let's see, 255, 125, 150. I guess it just makes sense I to get this I one should first. Do something. Yeah, it just makes sense to get that one first. And then we're going to be upgrading these two houses first. And we'll build a barracks. Whew. Okay, go guys, go. Hey, that's good. It, it gives me audio now for like them chopping wood and such. And it's kind of nice to not have the game go s quite so slowly. Like every... All of the workers are way faster now. Now, I do remember one thing I did last time before the game crashed on me. Is that I showed a little trick that I used to do back in the day. Man, does increasing the frame resolution increase the speed? Like the day's going by faster, the workers are all faster, everything's faster. I don't know if I necessarily like it. It's kind of... It's kind of crazy. Ooh, pretty sun glare. Screenshot time! What is it, F11? Yeah, screenshot. Oh, stay focused, Russell. Uh, one of the tricks that I used to do is I'm going to try to figure out where the enemies are coming from. Now my quest is current mission, rebuild the village and field at least 20 workers before the ogres attack. Huh, that there English though. Uh, if we select one of these trees and then select camera mode follow, it's as if I'm using the tree as a vantage point to spy on the enemy. I can select any inanimate object and select follow, and my camera mode will will stick to that inanimate object. Heck, it probably even works on the ogres. Yep, works on the ogres. I can select any object, any clickable object, and just press follow. I'm trying to get the deer. I wanted the... Oh, he's already on there. And now, I'm spying on the enemy as a shape-shifted deer. Little do they know. I'm not one of the forest creatures, but I'm actually a scout. Dun -dun -dun. Okay, now we switch back to our bar Malay, select camera mode follow, and suddenly we're back in our village. It's kind of like having a, a bird's eye view, an eagle in the trees, a hawk, a scout, you know, something like that. Uh, let's start upgrading these two houses. I'm going to upgrade this one first, it's going to make me like five new workers. Then I'm going to upgrade that one. That uses up all my wood, but those new workers are going to be really useful because I'm going to need them to upgrade them into warriors. Soon. Upgrade complete. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Man, that's that is fast. Upgrade complete. Which one? Really? That fast? Jeez. That's fast. Everything's so much faster now. I don't know if I can handle this. Oh man. This is a lot faster than I when I remember Ready playing it work. on the Windows XP. Okay, that's one idle worker in. Ready to work. Oh man, that's two already. All right, let's see what they can build me. In this stage, we start building things. We have the selection of a sawmill, houses, and a spear thrower barracks. Ready now, to work. The mistake I made last time by not realize, realizing I had a sawmill already. Ready to work. Was that I didn't realize this was a sawmill already. I thought it was another house, so I went off and built a sawmill way over here near the, the largest cluster of trees that I could find. Ready to and it work. worked out really nice for a little while, but I meant, I you know eventually Ready just to work. demolished it to get some of the resources back because I already had a sawmill, you know? And it just didn't make any sense. All right, now, all six of you guys need to get to, Ready to work. Sure, chopping some way. wood. And then you, Ready since you are idle... Okay, now there's two of you. Uh, let's get you on... 
like collecting stone. I need stone. Where is the nearest deposit of stone closest to a house? My two houses are right here. Nearest deposit of stone, I'd have to say, would be Ooh. this one right here. Ready to work. Oh, oh, you too, you too. Actually, iron is also another resource. I don't see an iron mine around, though. I don't know if that's even a factor this early in the game. It could be, though. Let me see if I can switch it to uh, advanced mode. Camera mode advanced. And using the air. This doesn't look like anything resembling iron. Man, if the game crashes, it's sure going to crash now. Because I tell you what, this thing's going fast as... Fast as blazes. Now that's odd. There's one idle worker instead of multiples. I guess I'll get him to build all of my buildings. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, uh, now we hold down the clicking button in order to shape it. I want to put it in line with the land so that they enter into this side, exit into that side. Actually, I kind of don't like that. It's like I suppose I should do uneven. something. Uh, I've put it in a terrible position. All right, all right, let's get this right. Where's the land flat? Where's the land nice and flat? Gosh, there's no flat land here. This is madness, searching for flat land in such terrain. Fine! This should do. I believe the enemies are going to come from that direction, so I want to face my warriors towards them. Man, they really could flood straight over both of those roads. I've got no walls up yet. I can't build siege weapons and things like that. Is that a sign? That actually has writing on it! Wow! The game developers really put that in there. Huh. I mean, this is a game from way back in the day. What is this like? Hang on. Work complete, sir. Here's the... Yes, yes, work complete. Thank you very much. Da, 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 da. 2004. I had to look at the box. I had to look at the box. 2004. Wow. I mean, just... Wow. All right. Let's, let's get up here and see what's going on. Now, we've got the workers' barracks. Um, I don't want to turn all of my idle workers into into warriors, but... I, I mean, suppose I should do something. What did it say? 20? How many do I have? Berserker? Barmalay? No, 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 no. We need that all to be in the ready. same unit. Um, so that's one? No, no. It's... It, what is it? Shift one or control one? I am uh, listening! Control one. Yep, yep, yep. There it goes. There it goes. Control one. Okay, that's a single unit. Let's see, I've got eight woodworkers. Let's get these guys in here. Will do! What? Already on my way! Alright. Oh man, I can't just have no woodworkers at all. Okay, two of you yes! stop. Go back to chopping wood. Where were you chopping wood at? Will do! I don't my care. spear is at your command. Excellent. Good job, soldier. Will do! Prepare to battle. Okay, two woodworkers, two stone workers. No iron workers necessary. Uh, let's see. My spear is at your command. Spear throwers are going to take resources in order to make. We're looking at man, it is going up fast. Okay, wood required, stone required. My spear is at your command. Excellent. Can I upgrade a house? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Nope. Looks like I'm all set on that one. Yeah. Let's check to make sure My whether or not is at you your can command. build anything else. Nope, nope. Alright, so, Warriors is 10. Oh man, I'm gonna have to turn everything into... everything into a warrior. My spear is at your command! Warriors is at 11. Didn't they say at least 20? Well, that means I'm going to have to demolish a house and build another house, aren't I? Yep, yep, that's what I'm gonna have to do. My spear is at your command! Excellent, excellent. Okay, I'm going to gather up all the spear throwers and set them right next to the berserkers. Let's see, if they're throwing spears, that means they're ranged. They should sit behind the melee attack. My spear is at your command! Excellent. Alright, let's get them set up. Oh, spears are ready! Alright, that's going to be control, and then two for the next unit. Alright, there they are. Now we're going to need to select their formation. Uh, I'm going to pick Phalanx so that they match up with the other unit. Unfortunately, the other unit has lost their formation, so... Okay! I'm going to need to reset them. Okay, two. 
Okay. Okay. These guys. Oh, yay! And then you guys. Okay, that's going to be one. Excellent, excellent. Uh, your formation is still phalanx. You're going to go up front. Excellent. Alright. Now, I've got more than enough wood and stone. Hey, that's not half bad. No, I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. Reset. Alright, everybody. Hey, how's it going? Unfortunately, the game at this point actually did crash, and I have I had to actually mute the audio from the original format and redub it uh, in real time, explaining what is actually going on. Because from my perspective, I'm actually still playing the game, but the recording program has actually stopped recording, so it just looks like this screenshot. Now, you're not missing anything. What I plan on doing is getting all of my warriors into their phalanx positions. And um, once I gather up the 20 warriors, I will fortify the village as much as possible until the enemies arrive. I'm going to get them all together. And unfortunately, I actually already dubbed this audio over once. This is the second time I've had to do this because my, um, my editing program crashed. It literally crashed, and like a fool, I didn't save. So, I can tell you one thing. First, the game crashed, and there was no save. So I had to go back and redo the first part of actually getting to this area where I'm fortifying the village. That happened first. And then, the recording, the editing program crashed. So, if there's a lesson in all of this, it's save early and often. It's save early and often. I hope everyone enjoyed. Hang in there with me while I fix these bugs that this game is having. I will fix them. And stay tuned for the next episode when we take it to the enemies. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.